everybody is drew again um, somewhere into season so we'll get these over with hoping for something something good maybe some more vintage material nope just special train so D strange warden we'll go with you all right let's jump over to the next one all right here's the second one This video will definitely be shorter than the last one. I could have used this hater on the Padres now that they traded for him. Rizzo. It's not bad. I'm going to get that hater. I don't think it really matters on this team. This is the Astros, so special train material. All right. Number three. Damn. Look at all that pop. I'll go with him. Alright, we'll have some... We'll probably have another one of these end of seasons on this video. Um, possibly some more skill change. Or, yeah, skill change tickets. A um, few players I gotta try to try to get a little bit better, so... We will jump into that after this. Alright, it's time for the weekly mission box boxes hopefully everybody uh is excited with their team's uh acquisitions i know some some teams bolstered up you know got some new guys some new talent new blood and some got rid of some guys so as you guys all know i'm a padres fan and uh, padres did good you know like i said I'm kind of sad to see some of those faces and players go, but to get Soto, Josh Bell, Hayter, uh, and even Drury, those are some uh, key elements that are going to help us win now and probably for at least the next couple of years. So we'll see what's up. Uh, looked like the Astros did pretty good too. Yankees made some moves. We'll see how that plays out. Looks like they're already losing 4 nothing right now, but it is what it is. You win some, you lose some, that's baseball. All right, experience booster. I'm going to go with the skill change tickets on this team. Don't forget to do your, um, don't forget about your postseason event and also getting your bonus uh, balls. I think you get five of them per month. Um, so that's after you complete your daily missions. Um, I'm close to getting that signature player pack. And then at 20, you get black diamond pieces, premium skill changes times two at 30, and then team selective diamond pack at 50. So that would be pretty good. Um, yeah, but so your challenges are right here. So once you complete these, you won't even get a notification up here. Uh, but just go in there and check. You get five of them per month. Five extra ones so you get to your, your things faster. Uh, special mission, make sure you complete these two um, every day. That way you can get what is all player diamond pack and then all the other things that come with it too. All right, so let's jump to the second mission box. All right, here's number two. Um, one thing too, if you uh, end up purchasing that the uh, GI, the grade increase for $100. Um, the last several of them that you purchase, I haven't purchased any, but I just did uh, because everybody else has been getting the uh, bonus package coming up. So you get another one. You get a second GI for like 12,000 stars. And on two of my teams, I, have, I definitely have enough stars and could use those GIs. So you got the money it's basically two for one from what we've been seeing it's not a guarantee but you know just just throwing it out there every time i see people getting the extra ones i kind of wish that i could go back and purchase that one so might be that might be a two for two for one so basically fifty dollars each 
And then it comes with a few extra little things. All right, this team, skill reset ticket, skill change, hit coins, all pretty decent. The players, no, I'm not getting any of those. Arcade balls, heck no. Pitcher stat amps. So th these are all actually pretty good. Let me see what I need the most. I know I've been using some of those skill change tickets and stuff. All right, I have 45 skill change tickets, kind of low. Uh, skill experience booster, nine of those. Skill reset 11, and then stat amp tickets, I have a lot of those. Hit coins, I don't even think I really even need those on this team. Yeah, I need to collect my upgrade ticket. Yeah, I'm, I'm probably pretty good on those. Let me see what I want to do. All right. Skill change tickets I need. Skill experience booster, I could use those. Skill reset, I can use those too. But I have pretty much everybody trained up. If you guys need some work and I have enough. I'm going to go with the skill change tickets because that's what I need to work on. All right, let's get this third one. Diamond, skill change, club coin. Rank coins, no. Premium player, no. Level reset, I have those. Uh, let's go with these skill change again. Double check these. Yeah, skill change is what I, what I think I need. Uh, I might use some of those right now, as a matter of fact. need to I need to work this uh, try to get some better skills touch mass 345. All right, let's go for this one. Yeah, see, I only have 59 of these, and I would really like to change some of the skills on these guys. This is the one I select. I think that's like the same thing. Finesse. Ooh, trains not even great. Nope. Dom touch control. So I could get a Dom. Hmm. Control artist. I think this is for location, right? Three, two, two. Keep that for now. Let me see if I want to do some other guy. This guy, Iron Will Ace. Boss Dom, two, two, one. So I'm losing four, not good enough for me. Probably better than what I have, but. Does that work? So 
So pitching machine is a skill that a lot of the guys in this tournament have been using as a third. I don't think it's getting nerfed, so I think it's a good skill to have. Fixer, definitely don't want that. I need higher levels. Higher levels with at least, I want three usable skills. Boss, Golden Pitcher. Dom touch, losing three. Dom touch is better. I could get a Dom train. I think, let me see. 77, 74, 68, 71. I'm looking at these base stats down here and then seeing where I can change them. So plus eight. All right, yeah, we could definitely get this going. So I will train for that, and then we'll have some more stuff on this video. All right, so here's the before of Morton. I'm going to go with the Dom train. If you look at the base stats, it's just minus 2, 69 to 71, minus 2 on the Dom. So I can, I can get that. Um, I could possibly get the location to be my second best. Velo 1, location 2, fastball 3. So I'll try for that. I'll pause it and then show you the end results. Yeah, like I said before too, um, love this new feature, but I like to, to, in order to save some points, train them to eight, 10, nine, whatever you choose, and then see where you're, you're at there. You know, if you already have like plus six stamina, probably reset it. That way you don't waste extra points. All right, I'm not gonna waste too much resources on this. Um, so what I'm gonna do is finish it off for a Dom train. Uh, I'm going to have to get fastball to two, so I'm going to do a, a five and four over five on velo, four on fastball. That'll leave location number three, six stamina, not bad. Uh, I kept getting higher stamina than that, but so I'm not going to, like I said, I'm not going to waste too much resources. Let's go after it. Velo, fastball. We'll just use a couple of these. No, at least one of them. All right, so. I need one more to fastball and two more to velo, right? So I get it to the, oh no, one more, yeah, one more to fastball. So it's the second, yeah. What app ticket is this again? Yeah, same thing, so. All right, so there we go. Um, plus 12 from below to location, plus three. So that's at 15 exactly. Yep, so we'll take that. All right, so I think he's in a better position. We'll skill him up. We'll grind him out and then put him in club lineup or put that skill set in club lineup. Let's see. I think I have the other one too. Touch, will, winning streak. I think he's been performing okay. I just, let's see this second. I got to see the second set real quick. Could get... Location V low to two or one two. I don't know. I'll work on this one later. We'll, we'll check stats out. I'll work on this one later. Um, let's jump on to the next part of the video. Buzz for ya. 
Hopefully we get some good, but probably not. I think I do have a couple refreshes, so maybe that'll help. Rowdy Telez, Luis Perdomo, 64 base. I'm not going to use him. I already have a bunch of SIGs and Primes in there. Kyle Lewis. Nothing. So we will just go with this pool host right here. Just because he's going to be a Hall of Famer. But I'm going to mulch him anyways. So. All right, let's jump to the next. All right. Uh, wow. Three A's. Hmm. That also would be cool for this deck or for an A's deck. Do little. That's actually pretty good. Closing pitcher. Camp. Nope. I should get the Mancini, huh? Because he's on the Astros now. There we go. That is what we'll do. So this is the Astros. One of the Astros teams. Let's get it. All right, the third one. This one I don't think has any refreshes. Oop, and there's Olsen again, this time on the Braves. So, let's go ahead and select him since he wants to be on one of my teams. All right, we'll move on to the next part of the video. So there's something, there's a new package, uh, a couple new packages. There's League Champion 1, um, it's $10, only get five different items. Not too bad, you end up getting a hundred premium packs, it looks like. Uh, Ultimate Vintage and some other stuff right there. Uh, I did purchase this League Pack 2. And what you have to do is you have to go back and go back to League, uh, regular League 2036. And go, I, I just did the playoffs, did the wild card playoffs. And won the season and then I was able to collect everything. So I'm going to collect all of that. Um, what it, in, what it includes is a team, uh, signature team select pack, a diamond vintage player, and then it's like about 200 premium packs. What's this position select of diamond ultimate vintage. So definitely a lot of stuff here. Um, so if you got the money, I don't see a problem with spending it on that. Uh, I did buy the GI and I'm hoping for another one coming as a a pop-up somewhere for like 12,000 stars. Um, let's go ahead and let's go ahead and collect. Let me see. I, I forgot to collect. Sorry, I'm getting distracted. Sucks you have to collect one at a time, but it is what it is. All right, I'm going to open up the, uh, so I'm going to open up two SIG packs, and probably that Ultimate Vintage right there, too, or the, the Diamond one. Oh, they're all in my inbox. Look at all that. I'll take it. All right, Ultimate All-Star Pack. Um, I'm going to open up this AL All-Star Pack because... Just in case I get Soto, um, he might turn to Padre. So there you go, twenty-one Presley. Not going to use that. Ultimate All Star Pack. Kikuchi. All right.
All right, so it's a diamond. Rafael Palmero. He was pretty good. All right, come on. Let's get a legend pitcher, Nolan Ryan. Not quite what I was looking for. Willie Randolph. All right, signature player pack. This is from that uh, the ball event. Another Diamondback. Now let's do this one. Come on, I want a starting pitcher. I need a starting pitcher. Oh my gosh. Come on, it better not be a dupe. Stammon, I believe I have Stammon. 21. Uh. I have the 19 Stammon. Of course, the 21's better. 66, 63 base. Could be anywhere from 11 to like 19 better in total stats. I am not going to play with that one right now. Um, that sucks. Why, why can I not get a damn starting pitcher in this damn... Look at one, two, three, four, five. And then I think last time, what did I get? Did I get a batter? No, I didn't even get a batter. I think I got a... I think I got Melanson or something. All right, let's see. Do I want to open some more of these? All right, I'm just going to open up some more of these packs, just the premium ones, save some of the other ones for some other stuff. A little bummed that I did not get something that I could turn blue or at least, you know, something that I could really use. It's like the hardest thing in the world to get a starting, to get starting pitchers on this team. I'm driving me crazy. All right, I'm going to special train them. All right, I already, I almost have somebody up to level six. There's a diamond. And a gold. Carry wood, that's pretty cool. 73 base. There you go, another diamond. We'll take it. Severino. All right, we'll get this Hunter Renfro up to six. That way his skills are blue. All right, well, I'm going to use a couple um, premium skill change tickets. See if I can get, a, get something there. As you know, I'm looking for a uh, pitcher's chemistry for my bullpen. Finesse pitching machine. I'm going to stick with the slow starter. I think he's more of a Dom pitcher. No, he could be trained either way, actually. He's more. It doesn't matter. Come on. Not 
quite what I'm looking for. I only have two more of these. All right, last one. Mm, two, three, three, but I'm not gonna do that. I might end up uh, using a green ticket on this slow starter. Um, I'm losing four, so it'll be a eight, seven, two. Well, actually, six. Yeah, because I can only get that one up to six, right? Yeah. So it'd be like six, eight, two, probably. Either way, I'm not, I'm not too worried about it at the moment. Uh, it'd be nice for me to hit on one of these, though. Premium skill change ticket. Did I get one? Just one, huh? Uh, let's let's go ahead and try it. No. All right. Well, we're not doing that. Uh, we're not getting anything there. Uh, let's, I wanted to show you something. Um, we've all seen it before, probably in the update stuff, but, um, teammate was, club mate was, uh, talking to me about it, testing your lineup out. You go to the, your battle lineup. So you select your battle lineup. Then over down here, you have the overall analysis room and you can go against different style teams. So 95, 105, 115, all the way up to 130. Um, for this team, I'll do the 115. And what it does is it's very quick. It just goes through it and it plays 40 matches for you. And so what you could do is you could try out different skills. Yeah, so you can go in there and you try different skills on your players and see how it works over the course of like 40 games right there. So I'm going to. Look at that one. Let's just save it in there. And then you can get your general stats right here. You get your average, your ERA. Um, how can you improve, you know? So if you go in here, you can see, you know, averages. Who's not doing so well? Who is? Um, play some in different spots in the lineup. And some good stuff. Pitcher record right here. Let's go with ERA. A lot of pitchers doing good. Channel Park, Zach Davies, Musgrove's been my best pitcher. Um, Stammen, Paddock might need a little help, but it's kind of also where they're at in the lineup too. Uh, Ashby. Yeah, Ashby and Paddock, um, two non-sig starting pitchers. Not too bad, the 194-238. One thing I did want to try was um, changing skill set on Zach Davies here. He has a good finesse boss Dom one right here. Um, then he has this set. And I'm considering trying to train him for Dom, but it's going to be pretty hard with him. I'll show you right now. So he's starting out plus four right there, plus 10 right there. So it's pretty hard to get the train for Dom. Uh, so I'm thinking about using another ticket on him, maybe a blue or something. But let's test this out. Let's see how it works. Whoops. So you go to your lineup, battle lineup, overall analysis. And you do it several times and you can kind of get a get a good idea of where your players, how they're going to perform when they're going against teams like this. Especially like in ranked and stuff. And if you kind of look, you got 1 through 5, 10. So you know that 
er, the first, sixth, eleventh, sixteenth, those ones are all your starting pitcher or your first pitcher. And then four is your fourth pitcher. So looks like my third pitcher had a little trouble on here a couple times. Alright, let's see what let's see what the results are now. So now I'm just gonna compare real quick. And I'm more worried about my pitcher. So. All right, it was Zach Davies, 0.15. And then his last one. Point four five. So definitely better. Uh, try it several times and then see what I get. Let's see how... Uh, All right, Musgrove, zero ERA, six games, 64 innings pitched, no runs. So Davies right there, 0.15. Channel Park, 0.91. Just trying to compare real quick. All right, Musgrove, 0 0.43, 0 0.45. Let's do one more just to test it out see where they're at see if i like the, the that skill set better and see if i should try to change it to finesse or let me know what you guys think oh shoot so it looks like my fifth pitcher had problems a couple times got beat up a little bit there And you just click on a spot and it'll save it right there. So 0.15, Davies went to 0.63. All right, so I can just play with that a little bit and, and see where where I land. I haven't had a um, chance to really do that before. I saw it in, in one of the updates. I just never used it. I didn't realize it was that quick. I thought 40 matches is going to take like, you know, 40 minutes an hour um, but it's really quick as you saw all right I will have a little bit more in this video um, so we'll just continue there this is gonna be the last part of this video um, had a busy weekend so did not do some of the things I wanted to do but either way I'll put this one up uh, and then I'll have another one up probably coming this weekend End of season, there's snow. I'm just gonna move on. I want something better. Huh? I'm a Ramirez. There's no snail signature right now. I don't know if we're signing them next year. So, I already have plenty of snail material in there. All right, let's jump to the next one. All right, here's the next one. I think I only get one try on this one. But, oh, man, I could use the Juan Soto on the Padres team that we were just on. So far, I think he's been on base every time. Um, not overly excited about <clears throat> the team's chemistry yet, but I think it's going to come along. Um, I know in the beginning of this video, I'm pretty excited. Uh, we had a really good win, and then ever since then, we lost. <laughs> so, it's part of baseball, it's part of the game. Uh, we will get better. Uh, one thing I did want to show on this team, real quick, is um, I got Morton, grinded him up, went to uh, regular season 21, uh, did the double, or the, yeah, the. 20% increase, whatever, and then I just kind of grinded him out for the, for the weekend and stuff, and got him to level level 5, or level 6, then I used some skill training tickets on him, there's Dom and Touch right there, so, should be working better than his other set, any eater mess, Giant Crusher, but we'll see, I'll test it out, do the overall ranking, or the overall analysis, and play with that a little. Alright, let's jump to the next one.
All right. Let's finish this one. Last but not least, the third one. No extra players. Oh, Jorge Alfaro. Looks different. I'm just going to pick him. This is an Astros team. Stay in 22. I'm almost to almost have enough black diamond pieces to make some of my players. I think Legends Black Diamond. Um, one thing that just came out. Check this out for sure. Um, these packs, stars, uh, packages that uh, you don't usually have the opportunity to buy. The Diamond Special Training. 1200 that's about going rate so that's nothing special redistribution tickets up to you if you guys need it if you have a bunch of stars and you want to use it go ahead these amplify tickets i'm thinking about purchasing um they're good to use and hard to come by skill resets possibly diamond packs i'm not doing team selective diamond pack i'm definitely not doing um but you can get three of these and two of these so that you're looking at what 12,000 stars right there on just these two items if you max them out um all this other stuff you can get some of that in here like i said kind of going right uh you have one diamond two gold there and then one diamond two gold would be 1800 right here so you actually save 50 stars by doing this package but you can only do once per week so it's up to you. If you got the stars, then feel free. But those are just my thoughts and recommendations on that. Um, I'm thinking about purchasing the... Uh, what is it? Not the Play Pass, but the, the one the League Champion Pack. Uh, just grind out one season. All you got to do is finish one season above this, and you get all that stuff. So I think it's a decent deal if you got the money. Um... I might get it for this team. I don't know. We'll see. If, if we do, it'll be in this next video where I'm opening those packs. How much time do we have left? Time remaining? I don't know. I don't see anything on there. Like some right here, you see five days, 51 days. Um, so I don't know. All right. Well, thank you guys and have a great day. Bye.